applications of improper fractions and mixed numbers in practice. Fractions have a lot of applications in practice. For example, we can express the part of a whole or of more than one whole by expressing fractions as in the following example. Example 1. Laura had to solve 210 questions from a math textbook in a week. She solved 235 questions in total. What part of the questions, expressed as a fraction and as a mixed number, did Laura solve? Solution 1. Laura has solved more questions than needed, so the corresponding fraction expressing this amount is an improper one, as it must represent more than a whole. Obviously, we must also check for any possible simplification for the fraction obtained. Therefore, we can write the part of question solved, as shown on screen. When this amount is expressed as a mixed number, we obtain the following shown on screen. This is because 47 divided by 42 is equal to 1, with a remainder of 5. Let's consider another example of the use of improper fractions and mixed numbers in practice. Example 2 1 kilogram of peaches contains 7 peaches on average. We have to insert them in 5 kilograms packs. How many packs do we need to insert 142 peaches? Solution 2. First, we have to calculate the number of peaches contained in one pack. We have the following. Now, let's express the total amount as a mixed number to identify the number of whole packs needed. As shown on screen, hence, we need five packs, four of them are full, while the fifth one is not full, it contains only two peaches. That is all for lesson 3.2.7 and the end of tutorial 3.2. To continue this chapter please watch 3.3 Introduction to Comparing Fractions. Ordering Fractions. Thank you for watching, make sure to like and subscribe to keep up to date with new videos. For more information, calculators, and tutorials, please visit www.icalculator.info.